Crackshot Holiday Choir presents the Holiday Bomb Plot Holiday Review. On the 12th hour before the explosion, home base fell for me. The greatest toy in history. Find it, old King Cracker Slash pushes the button. Hey, uh, Crackshot? Any chance you're into trains? Do you seriously think a train could be the holiday season's greatest toy? Trains are great. Trains are great? Trains are, uh, you know, they're, um, they're fine. What games can you play with a train, Lars? Here comes the train. Let's paint the train. Help the train be on time. I'm docking home base an hour. Eleven hours left! I found something. What is it, little box? Just Captain Composting's Candy Apple Red Sensible Electric Sedan. You don't want it. It's dumb. Ooh, I do like Candy Apple Red. Captain Composting isn't even a real hero. He's just environmentalist propaganda used to brainwash kids into planting trees and taking care of animals and hoping for a better future. Gross, you keep it. Yes. Pop in lock, the rainforest needs us. Hmm, that's the sound his car makes. Hmm, because it's electric. Hmm. Crackshot, my man. Let's talk dinosaurs. Feathered or classic? What's the answer you're looking for? What kind of dino are you holding? Let's just say it has the potential to be whatever kind of dino you want. Let's just say I don't deal in Dr. Dinos. Fine. Classic green. I'm afraid that the dino thank you. Authenticity matters. <clears throat> I understand we've recently come into possession of a dinosaur. Knock yourself out. Yes! Crackshot, what would you say to your own personal jet? I could spread my merry message across all of Stone Plank and Twine. Right, awesome. It's perfect. Great, hold on to that feeling and check out this much smaller, non-functional, non-jet toy plane. Really got my hopes up and then crashed them straight into Christmas Mountain. Is that enough? It's a piece of no call stuck in a stocking of betrayal! Yo, Locke, you want a toy plane? Today is the best day I've ever had in my entire life. Crackshot, you strike me as the kind of guy who appreciates a furry, cuddly friend. Whoever told you that is a no-good fur-faced liar! Sorry, I honestly didn't think this was an upsetting question. Yes, I've been to two conventions, but both were the result of a series of hilarious misunderstandings. And yes, I have a persona, but it was created out of a sense of duty to the other convention goers. I just meant, would you like a teddy bear? No, thank you. Block! Teddy bear incoming. <gasps> My heart is so happy I can barely breathe. That's the target, everyone. That, but for me. Got a toy tank, and nothing else. Want a tank, Crackshot? Already got a few. A few toy tanks or a few tanks? Pray you never find out, Lars. On that note, here's some news that sounds bad, but is in fact not bad. That was the last potential present I found. But I can always search for more. You better hurry because I'm going to knock two hours off the countdown. What's that bring us to? 25? 11 minus two isn't 25, it's nine. Thank you for your honesty, Locke. It's the best policy. Teddy Bear, welcome to Toystopia. What's that? All the toys I got today in a diorama. I hope Toystopia is a toy utopia. But it might be a toy Does dystopia. anyone else feel transparent? It's up to the toys to decide. I used to make these as a kid. This takes me back to before I got trapped in this costume. 
and driven mad by the lack of oxygen, and utterly consumed by mall Christmas culture. Can I play with Toystopia for a minute? Okay. But don't do anything to interfere with Toystopia's cultural or political development. This is our chance to know if toys have what it takes to self-govern. I understand. I asked for toys. And you failed. We're still searching. Don't worry. I'm not going to punish you. When the toy harvest is blighted, fault lies not with home base. Fault lies with the man upstairs. Sitting in his throne high above the food court. Santa Claus! Bring me his head! Can I just sit this one out? You can sit this one out. 